Hello everyone, my name is Julie and I'm one of Christian Assembly's Kingdom Partners based in Kenya. And for today's Daily Touchpoint, um, we're looking at Nehemiah chapter 9. We're continuing with our daily readings and I encourage you to read the entire chapter. It's long and it's rich and there's um, several themes that can be found throughout it. As I read it, the thing that struck out to me, that's really stuck out to me the most was about God's faithfulness and how by remembering, by um, looking back on the ways that God had been faithful before, it helped them in this time where they were really still in a, in a troubled place. And starting in verse, um, it's part of verse 17, it says, but you are a forgiving God, gracious and compassionate, slow to anger and abounding in love. Therefore, you did not desert them even when. And I think what the next part of the verse says is, you know, it, we could change it with anything. You know, for us also of even when we failed in this way, even when we chose lesser things than what God had for us, even when all of these things that can be said of any one of us um but a forgiving god gracious and compassionate slow to anger and abounding in love therefore therefore god did not desert them and god will not desert us even when and may we in this season leading up to thanksgiving may we be still and know to remember the ways that God has been faithful to us, the ways that God has provided for us, the ways that God has forgiven us when we have made bad choices, the ways that God has helped our families in times where we didn't know what to do next. And maybe that's where we find ourselves today, in a place where it's dark and it's hard and we need to be reminded of the ways that God has been faithful throughout the generations that he hasn't changed. And in this season where there is so much lo loss on a grand scale, as well as so many personal losses, may God remind us, may we be quick to remember um, all of the ways that he has been good to us the ways that he has remained faithful, of the ways that his character isn't changed by our, how, like how unfaithful we can be, that his character isn't changed by the circumstances that feel overwhelming to us today. So friends, be encouraged. May we not lose hope, not lose heart in the middle of the hard, but may we be quick to remember um, who God is, and that he is still going to be with us, um, even in these challenging days.